Hello everyone and welcome to Bloomer's Creations. So today is Sewing Sunday and grab two pieces of material of two different colors that go together somewhat and we're going to make a mini handbag as it says in the title. So, oh by the way, if anyone noticed my dress, where it's from, if you don't, um, um, notice it. The the video is there. If you want to watch it after this video, so yeah. Um, let's get started. So we're gonna have to start with one material. So by pink, move it. Thank you. So basically, we're gonna cut six inches by six inches. So pretty much take something with a measuring purpose or a measuring tape or a ruler or something like that and cut six inches by six inches like it's a square. And by the way, make sure you fold the material in half so when you do end up cutting it, it'll end up a long rectangle. Great, just like that. And by the way, this does not have to be neat at all. But the next measuring and cutting must be neat. So, we're going to cut 5 inches by 5 inches, sorry, but we are, and this time should be pretty neat. Sorry about the shakiness, by the way. So, we're going to draw 5 inches at each line, and we're just going to cut it like before. Oh, by the way, do this to both pieces. I, don't, I didn't video when I, what I did to the pink side, but I did the exact same thing. And... When you do all this drawing, you should do it on the wrong sides. So, like, you won't see it when it's the right way. Now cut on the line. Okay, let's do real music now. And we're done. Yay, nice. Whoops, wrong way. Oh, whatever. Oh, well. So... Here's the pink, and we're done with that. So we're going to get to sewing, and we're going to sew right sides together on both of them on one side. Does that make sense? Hopefully it does. So it should look like that. That's a bad position. Oh, there we go. Oh, bye. And now we're going to do the pink. Sewing time. Now, um... At the edge where it sews, gonna cut like that bit in half, I guess. Is that how you say it? Okay, whatever. So you cut it in half, and then you make a bunch of little triangles. Like that. Then we're gonna iron the material so it will be flat. So yeah, iron, iron, iron. Music, music, music. By the way, all these things I'm doing, I'm showing you on the coral piece of fabric, but you should really do it on both. So now, put right sides together, and sew on each side, except on one of the long slot sides, leave like two inches of space in the middle. You'll see why soon. So, here I am, sewing. Yeah. Now, turn it the right way. Then, um, the, fold it in half. And the side that you don't want to see, you should see right now. And we're going to put on some handles. So, get some ribbon, about 7 inches long. And just sew it in, I guess. And now, um, I'm just going to sew it. And then, we're going to do the other side. Um, yeah. Then, we're going to sew the other handle on. So you're going to flip your bag around and sew it like you did. And then on two of the sides where the handle isn't, you're going to sew it. Well, you're going to hand sew it because I try to sew it, like, properly, like, on the sewing machine. But it was too thick, so I'm going to hand sew it. 
And now for the other side. Here is the before and after. I love it. I know I say this every time, but it's so cute. And here's how it is on a doll. And it fits perfectly. I love it. It's so cute. And guess what? You can use it as a purse as well, not just for dolls. If you like the way I made the bag, you should give this video a thumbs up and like it. And if you think someone else would like it, you could share it with them. And if you haven't already, you should subscribe. Thanks for watching!